Hey guys, it's Christina. How's it going? So I've been doing a lot of stuff on my house lately. I've been trying to get some new pieces and I really love those. <laughs> I've also been trying to just reorganize things and today I wanted to go through and just declutter. So I wanted to take you along on that with me. Like most things I've done on my channel, I usually try to do things pretty fast or find like the quickest way to get things done. And so this video will be that same type of thing. So for me, what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to set a certain amount of time and I'm gonna work on the rooms I think need it the most. So that way, you know, I'm using my time better. Okay, and for me, I have a set place where I like to actually keep things that I'm trying to get rid of throughout the month or week or whatever. And so I actually have some spots in my garage where I like to maybe have a box there and I'll put things into that. And one thing I wanna work on is not letting it build up too much because sometimes I'll go out in my garage and there's like all this random stuff. So I'm gonna to try to be better at it and maybe like set a day and get it all like taken care of so it's not just like building up. All right, so the two rooms I'm really gonna focus on the most are actually three. <laughs> um, I'm gonna focus on the kitchen because I think that needs a lot of decluttering. I'm also gonna focus on some of my hallway closets which have like linens, papers, random stuff. And then I'm also gonna go through my room. By the way, I'm just taking about five minutes in each room. I just wanna show you how much I get done in just five minutes, 15 minutes total because I'm doing three different areas. Okay, the first area I'm gonna start in is my spice cupboard. And I actually have them organized by letter, which has worked for me so far. Um, eventually I'll get like a better system, but this is good for now. <laughs> and I'm basically gonna go through and see if anything is empty or can be thrown away or is just really old. So that's what I'm gonna do first. All right, I actually don't have a bunch of different things in here right now because a lot of it's in the dishwasher. So I guess a lot of it's being used, so that's good. Um, all right, I'm gonna get rid of this. This is not good anymore. Then I'm gonna think about these lids and see if I even use any of these anymore. So I'm gonna get rid of that little Tupperware thing. Then I'm gonna look at my dishes here and see if I use all of these. Pretty much do. These are little like Halloween goblets, so I actually might take those into the garage and put them into the Halloween section. So that's what I'm gonna do. Hey, this cupboard's pretty ugly. <laughs> All right, so I have a bunch of my appliances on this because I don't like to have my counters all cluttered. So I'm gonna go through this, make sure I'm using everything still. Never ever use that. I just got this, this isn't the cutest. Never use those ever. Same with this. I never use this either. Okay. Yep, I pretty much use everything else there. Okay, I've probably been going for five minutes and this is what I have so far. So pretty good. Putting those in the Halloween out there, throw it away, throw it away. And then these, I don't know if I can donate those, but I guess we'll see, probably throw away. Okay, so now I have this hallway cabinet that I want to go through a little bit and try and declutter, as you can see.
So here's my little cupboard. It could definitely still use some work, <laughs> but that's good for today. I just wanted to get some time in to get rid of some things and I think it looks better already. And these are a lot of things I'm getting rid of. They're just random like magazines, album, art that I, yeah, I don't need that anymore. And then just random scraps of paper and things that I'm just not even using. Okay, this is stuff that's just old or has been used up that I need to get rid of. And these just go up here on my little vanity that you've seen before. Okay, this is a box of some scarves and hats and stuff. And I just want to see if I even use all these anymore. Here's another box full of some supplies, like little school supplies, obviously. So I want to make sure to look at these, donate these, and trash. Okay, one thing to be aware of is once you have all your things in that one spot in your house, of course it's important to take it somewhere to donate it, or maybe you're recycling or throwing something away. Um, if you are going to donate it, just be aware, and you might know this, but um, right now at this period of time, a lot of places that are taking donations actually require an appointment right now, just because of... Um, I don't know why it could be because of COVID and stuff, but, um, so I'm going to try and set an appointment. And as soon as I know when my appointment is, I'm going to just load up my car. So that way I can just put everything in. And then when I have my appointment, I just take it down maybe after work or something. I'm going to try to line it up that way. So I would encourage setting up an appointment, then loading up your car before. So it's all ready to go. Okay. And that is how I typically do a declutter. Um, I'm thinking about maybe setting like a certain time of month I do this or I don't know lately I've just been kind of doing it whenever I feel like things are building up or I have a lot more to work with and maybe clean. I feel like when you declutter it's so much easier to keep things clean so I would highly recommend doing this at some point or setting a day to do it so. Alright if you like this video please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe and thank you so much for watching.